Welcome back to Wasteland 2. We have just defused the bomb at Silo 7, which seems to have set off a chain reaction of crazy in the Temple of Titan and or the Canyon of Titan. So I think I need to get back there and defuse the explosive situation. And hopefully the bomb doesn't go off in route. I, I really hope they don't launch the nuke. Please don't, please don't. Like, I'm seriously expecting the entire desert to just, like, go up in flames any moment. Oh, whoa. Mysterious Shrine, hello. That is definitely a bit of dirt, but it's not highlightable. Like, I can't dig it up. Huh. That's weird. Whoa! Okay. I don't even know. Approach a small plaque on the base to read the inscription, only to discover the inscription to be several pictures of cubes instead of words. Huh. We just got four levels up. Or four of our characters leveled up, I mean. Damn. That was, what, 900 XP? I think that's what it said. That was a lot of XP. Copy, Echo One. Echo One, congratulations, Echo. Four skill points, not enough. Five, not quite enough. Six, that is enough. What was I going to give you? Is it field medic? Yeah, your field medic skill is good enough. Leadership, that wouldn't be bad. Surgeon? Well, he does keep messing up his surgeries. Yeah, let's make you a better surgeon. Okay, demolition skill is quite good enough. Let's upgrade your shotgun skill. Damn, she has a lot of points. Definitely does not need more safe cracking. I could almost give her just, like, another skill. Yeah, I mean, she doesn't really have a third skill. Technically, there's Animal Whisper, but I don't really care about that. Maybe I should. I could get it up to skill level 6, which is not bad. Eh, what the hell. I almost never use it, but who cares. I'm sure one of these days it'll come in handy. Please don't set off the nuke. Okay. They didn't set it off. Yet. There's still a chance. Father Nola has been shot. That's not a good start. Has the Diamondback Militia taken over? What the hell happened? 
You bastards, fuck you too! You disabled our nuke and now we've lost control over the canyon. Good! You shouldn't have control over the canyon. All my brothers have perished fighting off the raiders and the DBM. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> you suck too. The difference is that we suck, but we're alive. Whereas you're dead. Fucker. Okay, what the hell has happened? So everybody died fighting off the DBM, so... It, does that mean nobody took control? I can't, I can't believe the forces just perfectly neutralized each other. Somebody must have won. So who's left? DBM? Raiders? Oh, shit. Chaos Pistolier? Huh? Chaos? What the... Is there anyone else here? Who the hell are the Chaoses? I've never even heard of them. Are these a, a faction of raiders? Like, what? I don't know, but I think it's time to start shooting. What's her armor? Two? I'm definitely not going to be using energy weapons. Shall I surprise him? Oh, you, what? Oh my god. Okay. Let's try that again. When he's looking the other way. That was supposed to be a burst. You did. You only shot once. What? I. I don't even know. Also, what is up with the lighting here? Look at this. Holy crap! Anyway, uh, burst fire, definitely. Beautiful. Uh, maybe I should have headshotted there. Should probably get some cover. Yeah, let's get some cover. Oh, right, there's only one shot in there, so we can't really burst fire. Damn it! Balls. Oh no, it's a smig! Okay, so. Let's go for this. Oh, right, she needs to get close too. Well. Shit. Just out of range. Well, I could move. Uh, but then I would be standing up. Oh, Theodore, right. You suck. But you have a lot of ammo, don't you? You do. It's okay. Theodore, just trust in the power of the dildo. Believe. The dildo has let you down. I, I should not have bursted. He only had like 30 something hit points. 
Okay, so let's test this. So there's a 100% chance to hit. So I was thinking, is it possible to have a over 100% chance to hit that is then capped to 100%? So that if you go to do something like a headshot, which reduces your chance to hit by 40%, it won't actually reduce it by 40% because you had some overage that then applies. Let's test this. So if this is true, then there should be a greater than 60% chance to hit. There is. Okay, so there's a 5% overage when I'm not headshotting. It's basically 105%. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. You really threw a stick of dynamite just to hit one person? Loser. Come on. What's the range on this thing again? It's not much. Hmm. Yeah, up close and personal. Rat a tat tat. Okay, now I do need to move closer. And you're dead. Is he going to move or is he going to keep lobbing? He's probably just going to keep lobbing. I'm still out of range. Ambush or cover? Uh, since he's going to lob, I'm going to just ambush. Because if I go here, then he might be able to hit three of our people with one grenade. Okay, headshot? Oh, not enough AP. <laughs> Once again, just hit one person. Um, would it be close enough? I don't think so. No. Okay, you're definitely going to be dead. <laughs> okay, you're definitely going to be dead. That sounded nice and wet. Ranger. Ooh, we have level... Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, he has another attribute point because he's level 20. Sweet. Okay, let's definitely upgrade some machine guns. Because she is really bad with them. Got some fuckers up here. They have a bit of a height advantage. Is there anyone anywhere I can crawl up to? Not that I see. Hmm. I think I maybe want to like snipe them and then just take cover and wait for them to come to us or something. Let's see what's over here. It's a freaking slaughterhouse. Oh shit, they covered up this entrance. I can't even get down there. Huh. That's the symbol of the Diamondback Militia on the wall there. The 
DBMs are right there? What the hell? Are they waiting for us? What are they doing? Looks like the DBM and the Raiders are going to have a face-off. They're just patiently waiting for me to come along. Okay, who's my longest sniper? Is it that gun? Or is it... Yeah, okay. So it's Helen's gun. And she can shoot them. So I think I might want to take cover here. But then my close-range people, of which there are two, will be completely useless. Ah, yeah, fuck it. Fuck cover. Who needs cover? Fuck it all. Pyramid shape. You two don't crouch. You two do crouch. And everybody shoot. That person. He, he literally didn't even notice. Okay, shoot that person. He noticed. That is a terrible chance. That's pretty bad. Oh, that's cover. He's a lobber, though. He's gonna have to get closer. Yeah, I don't think he can lob from there. So, let's just ambush. Can he lob? Is he gonna lob? Oh, shit, he can. Okay, but only to the front most person. I need to take out that Grenadier. Uh, oh, there's no ladder on this side. Crap. That's awkward. Alright, let's take out this one. 69? Sure. Sounds sexy. Three hit points. You know what? Let's start going up this side. Screw that guy. I was about to say something really weird, so I just kind of mentally erased it from what I was going to do. I still kind of want to say it, though. No, I won't. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just shoot you. Eighty-two percent? Not bad. Nice. 100% chance to hit? Hell yeah. Guaranteed kill. Hmm. Just gonna say hello to this guy. Ooh, there's two of them back here. Perfect. Let's say hello to both of them. Merry Christmas! What the fuck? Oh, there's only one shot in it. That's right. Damn it. Ow. Ow, holy crap, she's almost dead. That's really bad. Alright, fuck this guy. Ah, if I want to do the double burst, I can't even get up there. Alright, single burst. Yeah, Yuli is, Yuli is in trouble. That's a terrible shot. Let me see if I can... Uh, can I... I can't move. I can't move and shoot. I want to shoot this guy. Um. Do I take this shitty shot? I guess. Alright, 
All right, we need to move in. Yeah, we really, really need to move in. Just keeping our people, keeping our people spread out for the grenadier. Fifty percent, sixty percent. It's not bad. Ah, oh, she could almost shoot twice with the number of action points she has, but not quite. Let's move closer. I don't know if that helped. Damn. Okay. I should probably run her away. Maybe. Okay. Yes, yeah, so this guy can easily die. This guy is not going to die. So she needs to take cover. He <laughs> just like spun around in a circle. Okay, you are definitely dead. Lucky crit. And you're dead too. Goodbye. Never mind. I was just kidding. I don't need to burst you. Okay, I did need to burst you. What the fuck? What is wrong with my people? Alright, you need to fucking die. Not bad, Theodore. I'm feeling the power of the dildo coming back into play. Uh, let's just ambush him. If he comes around the corner, he's going to get a face full of two barrels. Oh, here we go. <gasps> yeah. Can I shoot directly under to this guy? Let's find out. No. Okay. Shouldn't need to burst this guy. Right? Thank you. Do I want to go see what's happening here? Well, they're not doing anything yet, so hold on. I'm just going to clear the rest of the camp first. I'm guessing all the doors... Yeah, everything's probably been shut, so I probably have to go out the front gate. Is my guess. Unless... Oh, I don't see the curtain, and there was an entrance in there. But the entrance is probably boarded up, too. Let's go see. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's go see what's going on. Bridewell's here. Oh, oh, open. Is it locked? 
Oh, it's locked, okay. That's weird. You'd think it'd say, like, it's locked when you try to open it, but it just says nothing. <clears throat> Please don't shoot each other. I know this is kind of awkward, just hold on a second. And we're here! Die, you sons of bitches! Well, they are raiders. I mean, okay. What about me? You bastards ruined our only chance to hold this place together. Now the raiders have taken over the canyon. For your crimes against the Diamondback Militia, you will now pay. Oh, okay. 300 hit points. Ooh. God, why did she... Oh, God. That's... This is a bad situation to be in when someone has a shotgun. No! No! They sound like fucking zombies. What is up with the noises? Like, what the fuck is that? Like, what did the script say when they got in the booth? Like, did it just say, make zombie noises? And if not, then how did the people doing the recordings go like, Oh yeah, that's a good take. Let's keep that one. Fucking weird. Alright, now would be a very good situation for a Granada. What if I throw a dildo at their faces? Nah. Alright, so it bypasses all armor and does 100 damage, so it's not gonna kill anybody. Do I need it though? I don't. I mean, I don't need it. It's pretty freaking good though. Yeah, I mean, this is a pretty good place for a grenade. Now, let's get spread out so the shotgun isn't so effective. Okay, my sniper. You need to run. Okay, unfortunately, they're a little bit spread out as well. Can I even hit two at the same time? No, I'm gonna have to reposition myself. Okay, um... Can I hit all three? I know I can hit two at the same time, but can I get it so I can hit all three? Maybe? This might work, hold on. Uh... Yeah, okay, this actually might work. Uh... Uh... Mm, nope, only two. Let's take out this guy. Um, I should probably kill you. Because I don't... There's no way... Well, I could... Three armor. Six shots. Could do 120 damage. Three armor penetration. No, she's not going to die this turn with the Uzi, so I might as well kill this guy. <laughs> that animation. It's like he just slipped on a banana peel or something. She really does sound like a zombie. Oh shit. Rest in peace, Harper. Are you too close? Oh wait, I forgot there's another dude. I forgot about you. Yeah, you're a little bit too close, so I think I'll have a better chance if I move back here. Yeah, uh, no, it's the same. Whatever. Oh my god. That was a 50-something percent chance for each roll, right? So the chance of one of them missing was basically one in two. The chance of two missing was one in four? 
And the chance of all three missing was one in eight, I think? <sighs> you depress me, Theodore. Alright, well we might be able to kill this guy. Yes, okay. Or, actually, that was a woman. Sorry! Well, I mean, she's dead now, so who cares? <laughs> that missed. <laughs> Looks like she tried to shoot Theodore in the dick and then somehow missed. I guess his dick is just that small. Oh, burn. Now you're dead. Looks like Harper's feeling a bit stiff. Ooh! That might be a better submachine gun than the other one. Over under, I already got it. <laughs> That's what Blackwell was using, or Brightwell, I mean. Black leather combat vest. Ooh, I could use that. A whistle. Click 17. <laughs> Click 17. AKA non copyright infringing Glock. <gasps> Another dildo! Yes! Thank God! Thank you, DBM Gunslinger. You were so unimportant, you didn't even have a name. But thank you for this dildo. I think I'm still a one or two dildos short. I think it actually might be a good thing that the Raiders took over. Because they're probably too stupid to launch the nuke. At least that's what I'm hoping. Alright, let's take a look at what I have. So first, check the dildo count. You have two dildos. Okay. You need one. One dildo. One dildo. She doesn't have one. Okay, I need one. You have one. You have one. You don't. I need two more dildos. Okay, I want to see if this looked good on Yulia. Black leather combat vest. Yeah. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Got her sleeves rolled up, ready for combat. Nice and practical. Yeah. Definitely looks more her style than the Amigo jacket. <laughs> Alright, let's check out this thing. How does that compare? It is worth a shit ton more money. It does slightly less damage, but it shoots four per burst rather than three. Hit chance is the same, crit chance is the same, that's the same. Chance to jam is less. Range is higher, capacity is lower. Armor penetration is higher. Interesting. When you do a burst shot with it, it isn't actually a double shot. It normally shoots four, and if you do a burst shot, it only shoots seven, not eight. Hmm. Okay, so it looks like it's going to waste more ammo, but whatever. Got plenty of this stuff. Thing looks sexy. <laughs> She's holding the... Like, the barrel of the gun, the end of the gun that doesn't even exist because it's too short.
Okay, so yeah, how am I actually going to get there? If the raiders covered up all the entrances, I mean, are they even down there? Or did they cover it up so that nobody can get to it? I don't know. I guess I should go back and see if... The place back here... Uh, well, let's, yeah, let's go back to the other zone. Whoa. Oh, that's interesting. So the map has been wiped clean and filled with the fog of war again because everything's changed. Huh. Corin Kane. Who the hell are you? You're like the leader of these people? Let's go see. Psst, Rangers, over here! Oh my god, he looks crazy. A servant of the mushroom cloud skulks in the shadows near the path. He, he's not in the shadows. Well, I mean, okay, technically, technically he is, but... It's not like he's freaking hidden. How come the raider isn't shooting him in the ass? Anyway. He keeps looking over his shoulder and acting very suspicious. When he sees you, he waves you over. I'm so glad you came back this way. I was hoping you would. Uh, why were you hoping? Because I want to join you. Oh! Cool. Although, you're a melee character, aren't you? <sighs> you see, I, uh... I recently had something of a crisis of faith when I learned that our Titan was a... Please don't tell anyone you heard this from me. A fake. It really made me think. What are we blowing ourselves up for? If our god isn't real. Wait, it, it actually is a fake? Thank god. So, I've decided to leave the servants and search for a real god. And since you rangers are known for wandering the wasteland and meeting all kinds of people... I thought you would be the ones to do my searching with. So, what do you say? Hmm. Sure, but, um... Just out of curiosity, which god are you looking for? Oh, that doesn't matter. Any god will do. As long as someone can prove to me that they're real. You see, I'm a very spiritual person. So having faith means a lot to me. I just need to find a faith worthy of my faith. Okay, what can you do? <laughs> well, as a former mad monk, he gets out his resume, I'm something of an explosive expert. And not just in the throwing them at people wildly sense. I can give you more bang for your buck. Uh, sure. Well, that was quick. Um... Oh, right! I was confused for a second. I was thinking, how come he was able to join the party? And then I just remembered, yeah, we lost Angela Death, which means we had an empty slot, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> my first step on my journey of spiritual discovery. I can't wait to get started. Well, getting started early. You're gonna find God through a, a hatchet and hacking, uh, hacking people's heads off. Okay, so, yeah, like, what what are you? Level 20? Nice. Super high awareness. So it's mostly about combat initiative. So he's going to get to do many turns, high intelligence, high charisma. Interesting. <sighs> but unfortunately, yeah. No, I can't take him. I mean, well, of course, I'm going to keep him on for now, but... His skill set is incredibly uncomplimentary. Like, bladed weapons, I don't want melee. Demolitions, Yulia already does that. Weaponsmithing, Helen already does that. Smartass, Pazepi already does that. Ah, gonna have to leave him behind. But for now, let's see what your hatchet can do. It's got an extremely high chance of critical damage. Well, go run up to him like a crazy man, I guess. Mm -hmm. 
by the way, I would just like to point out, I destroyed this cactus before. Something's wrong. Perhaps the radiation causes cacti to spontaneously regrow. Hmm. Now I trust them even less. Nice one, dude. Throwing a piddly piece of dynamite at a mad monk? Come on, they can take more. That's terrible. That was also terrible. Okay, we definitely need to get less spread out. Let's move up. The lobber's gonna blow us up, and we have a height disadvantage. I suppose the snipers could stay down here. Damn! Shot his head off. It's rolling down the hill. Thirty-five percent. What if I take a knee? Sixty percent? Okay, that's worth it. Don't think he's gonna throw a grenade at his feet. He's <laughs> trying to use a pistol. That's cute. Stay dead. Copy range. Red. Yeah, let's go for his assault rifle skill. It's lagging a little bit behind. Wait, what did I just see? What is it that I just discovered? Oh shit, is it the bodies? That's weird, the hotspot for them is like on the ground instead of actually on the bodies. Charred corpses, barely recognizable as human, lie in a large burning pile. The smell is awful. Ugh. What if that guy's still up here on the hill? The naked dude, the huge bomb. Who shall I kill first? Any lobbers? Shotgunner, shotgunner, no. Ah, oh, I didn't quite get him. 113 points of damage. Okay, I finally get to use his hatchet. Not bad. Let's see, is Corn Cane gonna get to go before this guy? No. 
Should I burst him? Yeah. So these are shotgunners too. So let's wait for them to come to us, because we have the advantage. They have to come to us. So let's just ambush. Test the Timp 9 out. 62. It's pretty good. Oh shit, there's more. They have snipers. So they're about to start shooting us. So they can't move very much because they're on their knees, so we need to move up after we kill these shotgunners. Yeah, let's start moving up. What's the range on this thing? Not good enough. Alright, let's just keep moving up on the snipers. Let's freak them out. They're probably going to want to get up and move if some crazy dude with a hatchet is running after them. That's my hope, anyway. I'm worried more, more about the snipers than the shotgunner. Wait, your sight is blocked, what, by this little ridge here? Damn it. Let's just run up. We need to get closer to the snipers. Close the gap. <laughs> That's cute. Ooh. Oh, God. Their snipers are more effective than my snipers. Let's start shooting the hell out of these goddamn snipers. Nice. Almost got him. Let's get up close and personal. This'll freak him out. Didn't I blow up this entire thing? 
Why is there one piece of fence? Alright, let's see if this guy's alive. Please don't tell me you killed him. Wait, he's not even here. Huh. Shit, he's probably put on the fire with the rest of them. I don't know. Maybe he made it out okay. Maybe he left. Because I did forget to come back to him. I wanted to see if he would wake up. Oh. They blocked off this entrance. Interesting. I smell a trap. What do you know? Travel. Why is the travel right here? It's weird. Didn't exactly place my people very well. Oh well. They have any lobbers? Nah. They do have a shotgunner though. Which means we need to take him out because if that shotgunner, shotgunner gets close to us, he can do a lot of damage. Well, that was easy. Might be able to get both of them. Hmm, this guy might be too far away here. No, I think I'll just have him. Yeah, he's just in range. God, this guy is just useless. This weapon just takes way too much AP. I should put some grip tape on that thing so it takes less AP to attack. I'm just gonna get close to him to freak him out. Although he does have an SMG, so he probably likes me getting close to him. SMG versus SMG. Who wins? The person with way more hit points. Let's get this guy to move. Let's scare him out. So I'll get up close to him and then have everybody else just do like overwatch basically. Do you have range? You do. So crouch and let's wait for him to run. really no point in overwatching with a hatchet. Yeah! <laughs> There's a toaster. Impossible. So, yeah, the rest of the map is just, like, gone for some weird-ass reason. That's really, really weird. Hmm. So, 
So I don't know if, like, all the entrances to the temple have been just closed up. I mean, I, I guess I don't need to go there anymore because the bomb is a fake, right? So there's no need to use my demolition skill to cut the wires or scramble the code or whatever. I mean, what does my quest say? Is it just all done, basically? Yeah, I guess it's just all gone. Now it's just reach Demonta. Huh. I guess the conflict is over, kinda? I mean, there's, there's gotta be more I can do. I don't know, like, what if I go to the Diamondback Militia Stronghold? Or their, their hideout? I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Anyway, I better end this episode before it becomes two hours long. So, I hope you have enjoyed so far. And I'll be back soon.